Hey, what's up everyone? This is your boy. I take you all guy here with another informative video. This is update week. Um, <laughs> the Moto G5 Plus got an update. I'll leave a link in the description for that. Uh, last week, the Nokia 6.1 got January security patch on Android 9 Pi. And now, Samsung Galaxy S9 has the full-fledged update. Official update, not just the betas and stuff like that but shout out to the beta squad thank you all for participating in the beta program and you know showing what samsung is going to bring but i actually like waiting on the full full package and here we are wow okay just that alone i i, I changed some settings already and i'll show you guys that in a little bit but when you pick up the phone man that's what you get all right you get that your notifications you will see icons right here through there so when I get more notifications to come in, you'll see more icons. But let's let's just open this up. All right, Samsung Galaxy S9. All right. Now I cleaned off the home page uh, home page of the desktop so you can you know get a clear view um, and nothing on the you know normal. I mean out of the ordinary. So um, Bigsby has gotten the update and she is much faster. <laughs> So, shouts to Bigsby. All right. And as you can see, the icon packs are a little different now. The icon packs are a little different now. There we go. Yeah. Uh, let's check out the dollar app. All right. So, you got your recents. You got your contacts. And you got your places. Okay. Full-fledged places. Shout out to Samsung. Shout out to Samsung Knights. All right. And I changed the whole gestures, and like I said, I'll show you that in the settings. Um, messages. Okay, this is what they'll look like. And it'll show you um, settings and things in that sort. All right, you got your little settings, peel. You can start up a new message, you know, right there. It's very, man, so far it's been very smooth. Um, yeah, you got conversations right here. Okay, let me swipe up home. And yes, I changed the navigation bar so it'd be easy. I just swipe up on the little dotted lines to do what I need to do. Okay. Um, you got the internet browser, of course, Play Store, camera app, things of that sort. So let's just go ahead and go into the notification settings. All right, here we are, the status bar settings. And I changed the grid. So it'd be much easier for me to pick and choose which one. So it's a uh, five by three grid right here. And then of course, you know, the volume um, and things in that sort. Let's see, let's go through the settings easily. Instant settings, dark mode. I'll show you guys how to get the dark mode instantly. Um, actually, it was right there from the beginning. So hold on, let me go there. Scroll over and night mode. Boom. There you go. Night mode. So you can just turn it off. Now it's in daylight, or you can turn it on. Then hit done. That's how you put it all in dark mode. Everything. So, like I said, let's just go back into the settings real quick. Shortcut. And you want to scroll down to features. You want to advance features. All right. So I changed the gestures. So all you have to do is go to the gesture settings. They got dual messenger. They got video enhancers. SOS um, messaging enhanced. They got smart pop-up view. Okay, reduce. They got motion and gestures. There we go. And basically, I turned on lift to wake. Um, I don't have smart stay on. You got smart alert. You got easy mute, you got direct call, you got one-handed mode, which you really wouldn't need it now. <laughs> Truthfully, <laughs> not with this uh, new, new system, but uh, yeah. So you just swipe up and boom. And yeah, basically, okay, I didn't show you guys that. Let me let me swipe up again. Here we go. Bam. All right, let me uh, go back to the nav. That's what it was. Let me go back out to the nav settings. It should be down here at the bottom. Yeah, navigational bar. Top that. And here's the navigational bar settings, the nav buttons. Um, these are the regular buttons. So let me tap that on. You can see. Boom. 
So I did the full screen gestures. Basically, I turned the full screen gestures on and voila, I have full screen gesture mode. So, boom, here we go. <laughs> yeah, man, this is crazy. Um, I'm digging it, though. I'm digging it so far. Um, first impressions, I've been very impressed with it. Uh, for the simple fact, look how smooth that is. This has been the smoothest Samsung Galaxy device has ever been. Like, just swipe up like that. I mean, there's really no real thing. Um, let me see. I thought I had the finger. I, I guess I got to um, set up the fingerprint again. Um, but, yeah. Bixby is much faster now. It's not too much loading up for Bixby um, to get you to where you need to be going. Actually, I don't know if, if, if it's my screen, but it's a little sensitive now because, yeah, you have to hard press for some reason. You have to hard press. Let me check something out real quick. Okay, that's the Google Assistant. All right, so. All right, yep. It's my first impressions, man. Um, I, I'm impressed. All right. Keep up the good work, Samsung. Um, let me know your thoughts on the new update to Samsung Galaxy devices. This is Android 9 uh, One UI by Samsung. Oh, okay, so if you all think I am, I don't know, um, a fraud or a fake, all you have to do is go through the settings, go through system update. All right, and it'll show you. Uh, let's see. Right here, checking for updates. And I'm on January security patch, so I'm on a full update. And all you gotta do is just check your update settings, and you'll see it. <laughs> Pretty much, that's it. Yep, that's it. All right. Uh, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. What do you, what do you like? What do you not like about it? Um, let me see. Yeah, okay. About phone. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. Software information. Bam. One UI version 1.0, Android 9. That's all you need to know. All right. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below about Samsung Galaxy um, Android 9 One UI. I'm out.